Alrighty guys, I'm live. I don't know who's here, who's not. But what we're doing, I gotta stream. I just, I can only stream for like 30 minutes. So, we're quickly just gonna rush through this. So, I have to get my own personal website up for personal things. And so, that's what we're working on today. Um, there's no fancy JavaScript behind it, really. Yeah, oh, I was gonna do that. Control C. So, there we go. Um, I'll work on that later. So, anyways, with this, okay, it's know, not Control Shift T. Alright, so if we get, if we pull it up, you'll see it's really nice background. I don't have a profile picture yet. So yes, I am a high school student. So. Have a Twitter, have my email set up. So it's really basic. Um, and it should be when it lo if you see when it loads, like hold on. I do this, inspect uh, audit. It's a really fast website, and that's kind of what I like about it. Yeah, but hold on. If I go like this, and then I refresh, and it's low end mobile, so it's gonna take a while. Reload, so it loads the background right, and it kind of fades in like that. That's really nice. We have my Twitter, which will pull up and stuff. Response to, yeah, whatever. Um, anyways, yeah, I was just showing that. That's a cool feature. If you guys are making your websites, okay, this is. Um, we need new music. Um, you know, just like that works. That's a really good thing, guys. If you are making websites like this, um, yeah, it, it looks really good on desktop. But what does it look like on mobile? That sort of thing. So in Google Chrome, it's right click inspect and then you click this toggle or it's control shift M. And then I can just close this. Control shift M. Whoop, control shift M. Oh, now you have to inspect and then control shift M. If I just like bring this down. Really, it was just control shift M, I swear. Whatever. Um, let's say like I have an iPhone six, so this is what it's emulating and stuff. What we don't want to open my mail and stuff, and then like what happens if it's in desktop? Yeah. Uh, yeah. And then like show device frames like iPad. It looks nice. Galaxy. Um, yeah, like it'll capture screenshots and all that. There you go. So there's that. So I need a profile picture. What I'm probably gonna do is just get my logo. Um, like dragon images and index images dash logo dot png 
Um, so yeah. Now if I refresh. Sorry about that, but it's too big here. So if I just, I wanna look at the avatar. So if I look, um, if I just look, open to this, oh, reveal and explore. This is what I want. Then I just wanna pull up the properties and it's details, it's 122 by 122. So if, to do this, I just look up image tag size. Um, this is a really good way where it's image tag. Yeah, so it's height and width. You just add into it. So I'll just put height 122 pixels and width 122 pixels. Now that should. And it does that weird thing. So I'm just, because I have my logo with a background. I'm going to say logo um, BG. Logo BG. And now if I go back here, there you go. It's really nice, it's clean. Um, yeah, hold on. I gotta do something with my phone. Yeah. So, it's fast. So if I inspect it and drag, That back up and what I like to do refresh load two seconds and the longest loading thing was the background image which is a 4k image so of course it's gonna take a little bit then I can do the same thing in performance if I just refresh So you can see when I refreshed, like as it fades in, which is nice. So it fades in like that. So if I just drag it to the bottom up, yeah, event log. And then let's say, I wanna look at the security, which is fine, audit. That's all I wanna do for now. So this will just run the audit. It takes a little bit, but for what I could do, so this is this font awesome, which is a really cool library of icons. And so they have a cheat sheet. And I think they have a shop, one, shopping basket, shopping bag, shopping cart. And then all I want to do, um, is to do add shop feature. I just added that just so I can recall. And then href. Shop. Um, this is shopping dash cart shop. Now, if I pull this back up, oh, it's still pulling it up. I can just open another tab. But as you can see, it's actually pulling all this information. Why didn't the shopping cart want to work? Oh, I forgot the T. 
There we go. Control S. Back. Refresh. So, anyways, back here, um, performance is 71, accessibility is 93. First meaningful paint. So, the background is saying it's taking too long to load. So, it actually says these JPEG, which I did. Um, yeah, and there's just different parts about it that I need to fix. But yeah, we got we now have the shop. So what I could do now, pull this up, this, and then just my routes index. As you can see here, I only have one thing. You don't even need to log in. And then add get shop page. And it's if they get shop, we're gonna read we're gonna render back the index with shop true. And then oh, there we go. So watch, it's gonna click here. It never, oh yeah, cause I launched it. I didn't use any name on, there we go. Um, but now, if I refresh and I click shop, it goes back here, even though it says shop in there. Um, and what I wanna do is, um, alert on page load jQuery um, this is um, yeah so if I just go to index and just add a script Somewhere, so like if I add a script just in this footer, script, and even if I just load it, and no, it says it doesn't want to work. Oh. Let's just do it this way, which it calls the jQuery library. And then, whoop, if I just go, yeah, your message. And you just press OK. So, what I'm going to do is say, um, the shop is currently being developed, showing main page. I refresh okay and then I want to just say if and then the thing we pass in is shop so if shop then do this and that did not work but you know what we're just gonna leave it unformatted like that so now it should if I refresh It should be like that. Very fresh. Wait. And then here, I'm just gonna add shop is true. Or no, shop is false here. Oh. Yeah, if false, and it's not false. But if I load this, shop is currently being developed, showing main page. Nice and simple. Let's see. Oh, it's 
My stream has been really quiet this week. I have no idea why. Um. Yeah. But anyways, you have your mail, my Twitter, or my professional Twitter, and my shop. So I have that. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull up my host. I'm curious what what's Hold on. I have to log in to one of my VPSs really quick. Second, there we go. Weird. Um, oh, so it just has the bot on it, it actually doesn't have a server. Interesting. Oh, because I have that. So, what I am going to do now GitHub. You see, new repository. Um, I'm just going to do this right now. But wrong thing. Push this, this. New here. Um, get in it. Um, then I want to say get add origin there we go and then I want to say get add here whoa get Remove. Get. Whoop. Why isn't my get ignore working? Oh, because it saved it, of course. Rename as dot get ignore. I can delete DS store. Yeah, there we go. Um, remove all added and get add. Um, get reset. And just, just to make sure if it didn't work. And then get add all. Get commit minus M um, first push. Um, get push minus U origin master. Oh, it's gonna make me log in. we go we're in my thing here then I'm gonna do get 
pull. And then where is this get repo? Here. If I refresh this, I should, yeah. Um, so get pull, what I do is get clone. Whoa, I don't want it. There you go. Oh, I have to get my password again. Um, yeah, and so if we look, we have, I'm going to phone it. This, there you go, it's logging. You can barely, there we go. Um, MP, and then it's PM2, hold on, I have to remember this. PM2 start bin dot www um, dash dash name is awesome Macaulay website. There you go. So now if I show ID one. It's online. So now if I go to this IP, which is I think it's this one. It is. Awesome, and then if I go to Cloudflare, so you guys can watch how I do this. Oh, I'm gonna have to log in. Um, give me one second, guys. Do do do. One more minute, do do do. Yeah, so now my website officially works. There we go. Awesome. So now I officially have it. It's going through Cloudflare, like that. So you just saw me take everything and put it through everything. So this is a really good way, guys, to look at this and have just a website done. Simple profile page, copyright, and even if you go in the inspect, it's, there's no, like, whoop, I'm in shop. I don't want to be in shop. Like if I record, it just recorded a snapshot and record everything that happened. Yeah. And it's a, it's a fast website too, which is really nice. Yeah, hold on, I forgot. Give me one second. I wanna look at something. Yep, I forgot guys. I actually record all my videos. I need to put these somewhere. But anyways, thank you guys so much for coming out today and watching. It really means a lot, and I will see you guys next time.